Getting set for race number eight from Red Horse in Charlottetown. It is the PEI Harness Racing Industry Association Autumn Series Final. Vance, up to you for the call. Crimson and Clover, Pleasing Pink, Pacific Delight. Doc Darrell, Grand Ave Legend, Shifting Views. Luigi Bizzacco, Diamond Call on the grandstand side. Top of the stretch. Here they come. The rough and pacing and a host of levers, pleasing pink, Pacific Delight, Doc Darrell, Grand Ave, Legend, way wide, Crimson and Clover, fifth into the turn, shifting views, six, Diamond Call, seventh, Luigi Bazzacco is eighth, to the back stretch they go to the opening quarter, pleasing pink, the long shot leader, it's going to be short lived, here comes Doc Darrell and Colin Shepard to take over at the quarter, Pleasing Pink is second, Pacific Delight third, Grand Am Legend fourth, Crimson and Clover fifth, Shifting View sixth, Diamond Call seventh, trailing eight, Luigi Bazzacco 29 seconds flat, open it up, on by the 3 eighths pole they go, led by Doc Darrell. Pleasing Pink is second, end of the turn third. That's Pacific Delight, and she's coming to the outside. Grand Ave Legend on the outside fourth. Diamond Call, third over now fifth. Crimson and Clover goes six. Up on the outside seventh, Luigi Bazzacco, and now trailing. That is shifting views. 59 seconds flat was the half mile. With three-eighths of a mile to go, the leader is Doc Darrell. Pacific Delight is second, pleasing pink third. Diamond Call coming out of the backfield. Three high and advancing fourth. Grand Am Legend is fifth, Luigi Bazzacco sixth. Seventh is Crimson and Clover. Shifting views on the outside eight. Three-quarters in the books, and Doc Darrell got them there in one 29 and two diamond call on the outside second third at the rail pacific delight luigi bazacco is fourth turning for home now the leader doc terrell diamond call on the outside pacific delight in the passing lane set the camera up doc Daryl and Pacific Delight land on the line together. They're in a win photo. 158 4. Okay, here's the slow mo for race number eight. What a great finish in the PEI Harness Racing Industry Association Autumn Series final. We'll take you through it. Doc Darrell won at the front end. He's usually a closer, a stone cold closer. I thought he had the front end today, 29 seconds flat. He was over there, 59, still the leader, and bossing it first up from Pacific Delight at the half. 129 and 2 3 white. Tip for Diamond Call up the backside and down the stretch they come. They're going to decide it here late. Yeah, they're all together. The four in the middle. Trying Trying to hang on, Pacific Delight is coming down the passing lane and Adam on the outside with Diamond Call. They're all going to land on the line together, but who gets it? We know UMI is going to show the slow-mo freeze here on the wire. You can see they are bunched up as they get to the wire. Four is in the middle. Yeah, that was Doc Darrell. He cut it all out. Three coming down the passing lane. Yeah, look who's landing on the scene. That's Luigi Bazacco. We'll see the freeze here from UMI. Here it is. Wow, that's tight. Looks like maybe the four. But we'll wait for the official result in a great race number eight at Red Shores.
In that wind photo, it's four, Doc Darrow. On his way into the winter circle in race eight, the four entry Doc Darrell Bay facing Stallion Five by Sunshine Beach from the Betters Delight Dam, Sir LBC Tam, owned by Morgan Shepherd of Brackley Beach. Morgan is the trainer. Colin Shepherd is in the driver's seat for the win in 158 and four. Doc Darrell capturing the PEI Harness Racing Industry Association Autumn Series final, and that tracks I with the presentation is Julie Jamison. Doc Darrell, 158 and four.